All right, what is up guys? Jared Spalding here. And if you didn't see my last video, then I did say I was gonna be doing an unboxing since the last video was not one. Um, even though I got the coin in the mail, I already opened it up before I made the video. Like I like I said in the last video, I'm bad at unboxings. I'm just try to put the camera down here. So I try to do them live, I guess you could say. It's not like it really matters. It's not like coin roll hunting or something or metal detecting. We want to do that live. I, I try to at least. Mm. See if I can actually get that open. But yeah, this is not really anything too valuable. Just a couple of silver coins, from what I can tell. I don't know if the self has done anything extra. I don't really usually get extras from people. I don't think they did, but um, I don't know. I know if, like a lot of stuff, sellers will send you extra stuff, but it seems like with coins they don't. Um, alright. Let's see what I got here. Just take it out of the bag. So I didn't even send a note or anything. Which I'm kind of surprised about. Yeah. Alright. Everything's here. It's good. Didn't get too much. It was only, I don't know, maybe 15 bucks or something. Yeah, that order. I think it could probably worth about 20. I think it was about 15. Um, maybe a little bit more. But I think it's worth about 30 bucks or so for the old Vish 6 Mercury Dimes. And, uh, a walking liberty half plus a bar recorder. I think the bar recorder, in terms of being oldest coin, is really the star of the show just because of its age. 1897, the walker is a 1942, and 1943, a 42, and the 43, a 41, and the 41, and the 42. And the Mercury Dime, so nothing too old there. Let me zoom in better on the coin. Sorry about all the noise in the background, if you can hear it. Um, but, let's see. This really does not want to focus. Mm, Alright, well, whatever. But yeah, this is, um, these are the coins that I got. Nothing like, you know, like key or even semi-key days, it's just, I got them just for the silver and the age. I like, um, Walking Liberty Halves a lot. Really cool coins. I also like Barber Halves, the Barber Quarter, obviously. Those are nice, too. Those are older coins, and the condition of this coin is pretty good. My rim's really worn, but, you know, it's not bad other than that. I don't think that it's got full stars and everything, got full and God wish Frost, full date, all the words are full, it's got all the stars on the back, so I think it's pretty good. And of course the Mercury Dimes, they're just, you know, I mean, usually they're not worth much unless they're in a pretty high grade, so. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and as always, peace, love. Much respect.